crisis in Syria has brought unprecedented worldwide attention to the issue of chemical weapons. Syria is believed to possess two categories of chemical weapons, blister agents and nerve agents. According to publicly available estimates, Syria possesses tens if not hundreds of tons of mustard gas. Mustard gas is a blister agent. Exposure to mustard gas causes severe chemical burns. The main symptom are horrible blisters. When inhaled, mustard gas destroys the lining of the lungs and respiratory tract. For those who survive, they are often permanently disabled. Nerve agents are far more lethal than mustard gas. Syria is believed to possess two types, sarin and VX. Both attack the human nervous system, controlling muscle function. The symptoms of exposure to both agents occur almost immediately. They include convulsions, vomiting, paralysis, and a distinctive pinpointing of the pupil. Death usually occurs from suffocation due to lung paralysis. Half a milligram of sarin is enough to kill a grown man within minutes. If it is true that Syria has more than 100 tons of sarin, this is enough to kill 50 million people. Chemical weapons can be delivered by rockets, artillery, or ballistic missiles. Because of the risk to the surrounding area, chemical weapons cannot be safely destroyed by bombs from air. The world has an interest in ensuring that the Syrian government maintain effective control over its chemical weapons stockpile. The possibility that these weapons will fall into terrorist hands cannot be ruled out, especially in the context of a collapse of the Assad regime.